Bai Haitan Dam is the third largest hydroelectric dam in China and the fourth in the world in terms of construction volume. The dam was built on the Jinsha River, an upper section of the Yangtze River that flows through Sichuan and Yunnan provinces, in southwestern China. The dam is designed in the form of a double arch dam with a height of 289 meters, the dam has a crest elevation of 827 meters, and a width of 72 meters at the base and 13 meters at the top. After a period of focusing on the development of giant hydroelectric dams, since the completion of the Three Gorges Dam project, the Bai Haitan Dam is considered the last major hydropower project in China. The dam project has been surveyed since 1992, the entire dam construction site and affected residential areas have been considered when implementing the project. Dams and reservoirs have greatly impacted the life, landscape and surrounding environment, especially the Kuiogia district upstream. On the positive side, the project has created thousands of jobs for local residents. However, it needed the relocation of people. 32 surrounding villages had to be relocated, with a total of 50,178 inhabitants. According to the plan, the dam will be built in 2009, but in fact, construction will not start until 2017. With a particularly fast construction speed, in July 2021 that is, after four years of construction, the dam will begin to generate partial electricity. By July 2022, the dam will be fully operational, when it will be capable of generating electricity capacity of up to 16,000 megawatts. To generate power, the dam uses 16 high-capacity turbines, each with a generating capacity of 1 gigawatt. With this large electric capacity, the Bai Hayden Dam project has become the second largest hydroelectric power plant in the world after the Three Gorges Dam.
The Pingnan Third Bridge is the longest arch bridge in the world. The bridge runs across the Zhaoyang River, near Pingnan, Guangxi, China. The Pingnan Third Bridge is designed in the style of an arch bridge. With this design, the bridge deck is suspended below the load-bearing arch by cables. The arch itself is constructed of concreted steel pipes, with this method the bridge will combine the benefits of both steel and concrete structures, creating stability for the bridge over time. The steel pipes are filled with concrete, making them solid and not warping. The steel outer part of the pipe has the effect of preventing the concrete from cracking and protecting it from external factors such as weather and earthquakes. The bridge has a main span of 575 meters, 1,886 feet. The total length is 1,035 meters, 3,395 feet. On December 28, the bridge was completed and officially opened to traffic. It is noted as the world's largest spanned bridge. In recent decades, China has achieved many development achievements, both in terms of economy and science and technology. In terms of construction alone, China has gradually risen to the top in terms of construction volume of roads and bridges, and many other massive projects. Many world records in the field of construction are consecutively conquered by China. <laughs> <laughs>